everybody. I'm Evo Rabbit. We're here back on Forza Motorsports to go back at TUS Chunky in this Drift Rivals. So we do have a new car. We have an S14 that's got drift suspension, intake exhaust, I believe cams in it. That's it. That's all we got on this car. We haven't really done any tuning, just factory drift suspension, intake exhaust, and cams. And we're going to see if we can actually uh, make something happen. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. I'll follow in the description box below. Let's get into it. So hopefully we can uh, do something well with this car and then maybe move on. So we need to beat his target of 30,000. We're going to see what we can do in our S14. And hopefully, like I said, we got intake, exhaust. And, uh, drift suspension, and that's it. So let's see what happens. Go full send. Oh, yeah, much better. that there we go yup okay yeah this is much better much better chance at beating this things how we're halfway there already the clutch kicks there stay on track look it back this way yup I think I got you this time chunky As long as we don't loop it. Man, this car is just freaking pegged power. So we've already beat his target as long as we can finish this lap. I should just bank this, but it's a fun in that. I I should have banked it. I, I really should have banked that. I did not realize that blue was considered off track. Alright, so we gotta go at it again. I should have banked it. I got a little bit too, uh, too carried away. And now we know we can do it, though. I kind of like how this car is handling, like, out of the box with just no tuning. Should drove that out wider, but just drift suspension. Oh. Now we did bank, we did bank that. We wanted to keep that, but it's okay. Clutch kick out though. I think we'll still be able to accomplish our 30. I think we got it though. We gotta not be greedy with it. Oops. Well, we were able to, oh, I have no steering in the front. We were able to beat his score. So we were able to actually come in here and actually beat what we wanted to. Oh. So we are able to finish that and actually beat the drift rival on that one. So we were able to get him best lap 34,000. We could have had more if we did not. Um, well, we did not actually uh, get too greedy. So we're gonna go to the next rival. Oh, it's on the same track. No, we're not gonna race the next rival. Who's the next rival and what do you have? What's the highest? 69. Woo! That is the highest on this challenge. We're two thousand. We're in 2000, so we could actually be able to uh, get up there in the ranking. We may actually have to try and uh, get up there even higher. Maybe a little bit more power. Maybe some different tires. So we beat that one. So we're going to go back. We're going to go to Drift 102 at Suzuka East. Probably one of my favorite tracks. 
Looks like this person only had a uh, a 10. So we got to beat him and get a high score and then see what our next challenge could be or see where we just get in the rankings here at Suzuka. I feel like Manjing down the straight is going to have to be what we really need to do to get all of the points. But we're going to see what the ranking is. Don't pull this lever because I had that set as reverse. That's what I did last time. What's what's the high score here? 60,000. Woo! All right, well, we're going to run our, our first lap normally and not Manji the straight. I said not to hit that button and I hit that button. Gonna go for that high speed uh, Suzuka entry. I mean, it kind of worked. Kind of stay in here. Trying to use the brakes and clutch kick. Go through. Yep, we got this. I don't know how that person's getting 60. He's probably monging the straight. Don't lose it. Oh, I thought we almost lost those points. Now we're going to try doing the whole Manji straight thing. We got more points doing it that way or not. We run this second lap though. I thought we were gonna go off. Oh man. We're in grass, don't lose it. Almost lost that. We did not lose all the points, though. We're good. We're gonna lose them here, though. What? Okay, so you can clip that grass. Okay, got it. Apparently, that was not two tires off. So we got more on our first. Oh yeah, that guy's definitely just monging everything. So let's see where we actually ended up. 34,000 is the next one. So we're gonna finish that race and find out where we ended up in the rankings on this one. Probably once again, in the maybe 2000s, hopefully. Maybe, we'll see. So Drift Rivals is actually a lot of fun being able to do this, but I'm noticing a lot of people are uh, where am I? I'm 800. Okay, so we're not too crazy far down. So we're in the 800 spot. Definitely need to step up the game if we want to uh, get up higher in those rankings. So I think that's going to do it here for this episode here on Forza Motorsports. We have some more rivals and stuff that we're going to bring in another episode because we get looks like we got three. And then we got Mediterranean and an open class. So... Get a drift score of 2,000 or higher in a single lap to unlock the number 13 Ford Mustang. I mean, I feel like that's easy to do. That's for another episode. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. Thanks for coming back. Appreciate you guys coming back for more episodes here on the channel. 
I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.